I believe that the strongest images in film, the ones that stay with you the longest, they are the ones you don't see. My name is Gustav Müller. I'm the director of The Guilty, which is playing in the World Dramatic Competition at the 2018 Sundance Film Festival. The idea came one day when I just stumbled across a 911 call from real life. Uh, the call was from a kidnapped woman who was in a car traveling with her kidnapper on the highway. And as she was calling 911, trying to get help from the operator, the kidnapper had no clue who she was talking to. So she had to like try and speak in codes uh, in order not to get caught. At first I was just like gripped by the suspense, you know, will she make it or not? But then what really got me was the fact that even though I was just listening to sound, it felt like I had seen images listening to the call. Uh, you know, I had seen the woman, the, the car she was in, the, the, the road the car was driving on, and even like the kidnapper sitting next to her. Anyone listening to this call would see different images. And I started thinking, what if you use this concept in film? The Guilt is a psychological thriller. It's uh, told in real time, in one location, following one lead character. The lead character is Asker Holm, a police officer that has been removed from street duty and set to work as an alarm dispatch operator. The film sets off when Asker answers a call from a kidnapped woman, and Asker takes it on his shoulders to locate and save the woman, only using his phone. My vision with making the film was very much to make a uh, suspenseful, character-driven thriller. But more than that, much more than that, what I wanted to make is a film that gives every audience member their own unique experience. The audience will start to create their own images of the crime and together with Asker put the pieces of the puzzle together. So yeah, I can't wait for the film to meet its audience and uh, I'm thrilled that it's gonna be at Sundance.